I think the value of thinking about it is a li- as a life stage is that it helps people understand where it is in the life course. So everybody knows what adolescence is. That's when you're going through puberty and you're in middle school and high school and you're having various issues related to uh, becoming physically and sexually mature. And everybody knows what you mean when you're talking about midlife. That's when you're in your 40s, 50s, maybe by now into your 60s, and you're getting older, you're beginning to age, your children are leaving home, you're moving toward the end of your work life. But we didn't really have a way of understanding the period from age 18 to 29 in that way. We've used the term young adulthood, both in psychology and in society at large. But that often has referred to anybody from kids 8 or 10 years old who are reading young adult books to people who are 40 and in the young adult social group at their church or synagogue. And any term that applies to 8 year olds as well as 40 year olds isn't of much use. I felt like we needed something to apply specifically to 18 to 29 year olds, that that would help draw attention to what's distinctive about them and hopefully lead to a better understanding of where they are in their development.